say money comes and goes, I hope I keep it. I'm everything, I hope I keep it. Cause when I say I want it all, nigga, I mean it. Nigga, I mean it. When I say that I won't stop for nobody, nigga, I mean it. Trust me, I mean it. up sweethearts we about to get ready <laughs> get ready with your girl so y'all i am going to do a voiceover because i feel like it's really really hard to talk and do my makeup at the same time okay it's really really hard so i'm gonna just talk to y'all over the voiceover so how's everybody today mine's been really 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 good actually um let me tell y'all what I did today. So today, I filmed this video, and it was actually kind of cool. Um, I filmed the video, then I did some other videos, and um, talked on the phone with one of my friends, and it was actually mind blowing. Like, I feel like I need to have those kind of talks all the time so that I can stay motivated. And then I look at this video from Shameless Maya and I was like, dang, yo, Maya really like started from the bottom now she here. Like she actually really did the dang on thing. Shout out to you, Shameless Maya, if you're watching. I'm she's probably not watching this, but I'm just saying, hey girl, hey, how you doing? But um, y'all, I was looking at her video and she was talking about how, you know, her original dream was to start off as a musician, and then she kind of like went into youtube and shamelessly decide to promote herself and then it kind of just grew into something else like a whole production like she got her own production okay like it's a studio building like in la and i was just like that is so amazing how you just like come up with one thing as a dream and then something else happens and i was like dang like I wonder if God really does desire this in my life. Like, does God really see fit for me to be a YouTuber? And then, like, recently I've been having these moments where, you know, I feel discouraged. Like, I can't do anything that I want to do and nothing's working. And then, yeah, she, I, one of her other videos was about a manifesto that she has. And I wrote one, you guys. I really actually wrote one. I might do a video on that, like, just a video of my manifesto. But um, if you don't know what a manifesto is, it's kind of like a letter that you write to yourself in the future so that you can like stay motivated and whatever. And like, yo, when I tell y'all I read mine, I kind of like needed to hear it. So it's good to get one. So if you don't have a manifesto and you are a new YouTuber or, you know, anything that you desire to do, I feel like you should have like somewhat of a plan or somewhat of a thought of what you kind of want to do in your life and if you don't you know it's okay um eventually it will happen you just have to let it happen but um it'll soon happen you just gotta believe in yourself and believe that things are gonna work out the way that god desired it to work out but i mean it's cool like i'm just starting to see myself evolve into so many different things and i actually love it like i love being able to do youtube i love being able to talk to people it's like at first, I was like, okay, YouTube is going to be something where I try to inspire other people and everything. And then, it kind of grew into, like, I really see y'all as family. Like, if I don't put up content or videos, I feel bad. Like, I feel like I didn't talk to my best friend that day. And y'all are really like my best friend, sweetheart. So, what's God, honey? Okay. But, um... <laughs> Yeah, so YouTube has really, like, become something important to me. And I kind of just want to take it to the next level. Like, I want to start engaging into different conversations, meeting different people, networking, and all that different thing, All those different things. And I'm kind of already doing that. Like, I did go to VidCon, which, you guys, don't be alarmed. Don't be like, dang, London, we've been waiting for a video for you for the absolute longest of your vlogs from you and VidCon. I have those coming, guys. I just have my vlogs kind of in order, and I don't want to, like, go out of order because of 
the timing on YouTube. Like, actually, to be honest with you guys, I don't even, like, pay attention to, like, things that go up big on YouTube like that. Like, sometimes I do. I'm not gonna lie. Like, if it's, like, a video, a music video or something like that, like, on my reactions, I kind of, like, stay up to date with that. But, like, when it comes down to vlogs, nah, I don't do that. That's kind of why I, like, separated it for y'all so y'all can know, like, what different things I have to offer. And, um, my god sister actually told me today, she was like, you know, I really do like your channel. And I kind of was like, why you say that? Like, what makes you say that? And she was just like, because, you know, you don't just do one thing. And so many YouTubers nowadays, they just feel like I have to stick to my one thing on YouTube. And I have to just, like, brand it. And that's going to be the one thing that I do. And I'm just like, I have so many different things. I'm so creative. And there are so many different things that I have to offer. And I don't want to just stick to one thing. So why not just, like, do them all? Like, why can't I do everything that I want to do on YouTube? And make it what I want to make it. It's my channel. You know, so I decided about a month ago that I was going to really transform my channel into my own personal channel. Like, I feel like people make YouTube out to be something that it's really, it really wasn't supposed to be. Like, for example, certain, uh, I'm not going to say gurus, but you know, gurus, something gurus, they'll be like, okay, well, makeup, I have to do just makeup. Like, I can't, you know, go out here and do all these other different things that were offered to me. And I'm just like, but if you have that sense of creativity or whatever, why can't you do it? You know what I'm saying? Like, why can't you do what you want to do on your channel if it's your channel like you created it so why can't you do it so i decided that i'm going to be different i'm not going to do the typical things that a lot of youtubers do where they just stick to one thing i'm going to do me and i'm going to be happy and I'm, i want to inspire others to do what they want to do that's kind of like the motto for me like just do you do what makes you happy like stay focused Stay engaged, stay open to new ideas, and just, you know, do your thing, homie. And y'all, I'm looking at myself do my makeup, and I'm just like, girl, you came a long way. Like, y'all, my eyebrows used to be hit. Like, I used to have squares, okay? Squares as eyebrows. And I'm looking at them, they snatched. They snatched to the gods, girl. Snatched to the gods. And, like, I feel like I'm going to start, like, doing makeup tutorials on Mondays and, like, different beauty tips. Like, I just did a... Mm, tutorial on you know washing and reviving your hair y'all that is so important make sure you do that like make if you want to reuse hair like do not throw all that money in a trash like if you spent a hundred and ninety dollars on some weed do not throw it in the trash reuse it like take the time out to wash it and reuse it and i guarantee you, you'll be probably more impressed with you washing it yourself and so i was looking at this video on youtube i wish i knew the guy's name i think it was phil if i'm not mistaken i think it was phil and um he did like this video on how to revive hair and he was saying that you should like boil it in water and vinegar and you know wash it and all that great jazz and i'm gonna do a tutorial on it because i know a lot of you sweethearts have been asking me to do those so i'm gonna do that and um i was just like this really y'all if i could like show y'all the di i'm gonna show y'all like the difference and you washing your hair like just normally washing it like with shampoo conditioner and that's it and then probably a blow dryer and whatever or air dry and then show you the difference between that and doing the soak and the deep condition and the steaming all of that stuff makes a difference in your weed so i was like okay let me do a video so well i didn't actually do it i said let me do like a little short tutorial on snapchat and uh people were like can you do a video and i was like okay you know i'm open to it and uh yeah so i would definitely be having that out for y'all probably in two weeks or maybe three because i have you know everything scheduled that's another thing y'all i've started to take youtube seriously because like i said i see y'all as my friends and i don't want to make y'all feel like dang you know i'm not staying focused i'm not doing what i'm supposed to do i'm not dependable so i've been like writing out and scheduling videos so that i can stay consistent and so that i can keep y'all updated and like making y'all happy you feel me but i'm also making myself happy like things are starting to change in my life and i'm really like enjoying it like to the fullest there are things that 
I've learned about myself that I didn't know a year ago. You know, like, I didn't have the mindset that I have now. Like, I used to just, like, be throwing up all kind of stuff on YouTube. And I didn't really, like, pay attention to quality, sound, or any of those things. But now it's just, like... I see myself going far in this and I really enjoy it. So why not take it seriously? You know, why not put my all into it? Like, I put my all into my videos. If y'all haven't noticed, I've been trying to edit a lot better so that y'all can have quality. Like, I don't want y'all to be just watching something dumb. Like, let me get entertain y'all. Let me put a smile on your face. Let me put a smile on your face today, you know? Because I know, like, at work, y'all be like, dang, I had a long day at work, and I just want to come home, you know, eat my dinner, wash my booty, and watch a nice show. And I feel like I could be that show for y'all. So, watch my channel. I'm going to have something for y'all, like, every day except for Sunday. And if I don't have something, it's obviously because, like, I had so much to do that I could not get to it. And, like, Shameless Maya said, it's so much work that goes into YouTubing. Especially when you're a smaller channel. Like, you have to really, like, do a lot. Like, with her, she has a whole studio production where she hired people and all these different things. But, me, I don't have all of that. And... I literally feel like there are not enough hours in the day, yo. Like, it's not like, there have been days where I have stayed up from day to day working on content or figuring out what I want to do for the next video or editing. Like, I've been drained, y'all, but I just love it. Like, I'm not going to complain because I love it. Like, I really do love everything about it. So, I don't feel any type of way about it. My boyfriend be like you need to you know eat you know take time out um chill out like relax and it's like I cannot relax there's so many different things that I want to do you know I just want to be happy like y'all it was like I want to say a week ago like I really went to bed and I cried myself to sleep because I really want to make it like I want to make it not make it like oh I need subscribers I need views like make it like people actually felt like they were inspired by me or you know people actually felt like they learned something from me I don't want people to feel like my life was in vain you feel me and I honestly feel like I'm on the road to that like there are things that I've noticed about myself that I did not have about me a year ago like going out I told my, my friend asked me to go out shout out to you girl and um Shakira y'all know my best friend Shakira I haven't introduced her to the channel yet but soon she'll be there y'all soon she'll be on there she watching me so hey girl hey but um yeah like she asked me out to um the some oh I think it was five points and I have a vlog of five points if you don't know what five points is but um she asked me to come and I really was like not with it but then like I was like you know what I am growing up because a year ago I'm like girl I'm coming you know bump this YouTube thing you know I got all the time in the world but now it's like I have to edit. I have to, you know, prepare for the next day. My grind is different now. And I'm not complaining. But, y'all, can y'all get into this lip? By the way, y'all, I'm still doing my giveaway. So, if you trying to get this highlight, that um spray that I just sprayed on my face, go, you know, do the giveaway things that I told y'all to do and whatever. Because I really am trying to do it. So, if you are trying to, you know, get it, you know, let me know. Whatever. But, um, y'all, this highlight is popping. Look at that highlight. Look at this face. Like, get into this face. Okay? Get into it. I was highlighting the crap out of my face. Like, in love with highlighting. But, anyways, y'all, like, everything has been going well. Um, I'm trying to stay consistent. Um, it's different for me. Because I'm the type of person where I used to, like, start things and give up. But now I'm learning how to actually go through with things. And I'm enjoying it. But, yeah, like, yeah, I'm still highlighting my face. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm blushing now. I'm blushing. But, um, yeah, so everything is just going great, y'all. I'm learning. I'm growing up. And I'm seeing different things 
happened in my life that I do approve of. And I thank you guys so much for all the support that you guys have given me. I thank you so much for having my back because I'm noticing that y'all really be having my back. You know, when people say things about me, y'all be coming in clutch, you know. So, I just feel like I'm going to have y'all back and stand up for y'all, you know, be that be that person for y'all like i'm gonna start having these little rants where i encourage y'all like when y'all feeling down and whatever i'm gonna start having those because i need to do that to myself sometimes so yeah i'm gonna start doing that for y'all so yeah, it's about to get lit but yeah thank you so much for everything y'all i thank y'all so much for i'm still highlighting i thank y'all so much for everything that y'all done this far um, for the people who are rocking with me, I love y'all. One day this video is going to go somewhere else and maybe I might get famous. Who knows? I don't know. But, um, I can care less about that. I just really want to make sure everybody is on one accord. And, yeah. So, that's just how that goes. Yeah, but I am just so thankful for everybody. Um, make sure y'all are sharing videos so people can see, you know, what's going on over here in Sweetie Heartland. Um, y'all, if y'all want to purchase this wig, it came from Wigs Boutique. Um, shout out to Chris. I do have a 15% off code for you and that is London love so make sure if you want to get a wig you know put in that 15% code okay put it in you know put it in and now this video is not sponsored you know I just had to hook y'all up with a little code or whatnot so yeah it's lit but I really did like this wig um although there were a little bit of imperfections um I still did like it and I'm gonna start doing a lot more wig reviews for y'all because I think I see that y'all do like those and I be getting kind of lit when I do them so I'm gonna start doing more of those for y'all I'm gonna start doing more of everything y'all are just gonna see so many different things and I'm excited like I'm so excited to show the things that used to go on my mind like y'all I used to dream of doing these type of things and now it's like happening and it just amazes me how I used to be like okay I need to find somebody to help me do this help me do that and now I'm just like I can do it you know with God me and God got this like if I put it in God's hands everything will be okay and he just opened all these different doors for me like I have my all my equipment minus I lost my vlogging camera but I had an extra one to God be the glory but I need to find my other one y'all my perfect one is I don't know where it is but I have the one that's next to the closest to it so it's okay it still has really good um it still has really good display so it's kind of okay but I really liked the other vlogging camera that I had so yeah I don't know how I managed to lose that but yeah it is what it is but yeah I'm gonna start doing um a lot more things so y'all will see more come from me very very soon um I'm so thankful about everything y'all look at my little green piece I like it it's so cute but um yeah I just love y'all I really love y'all y'all don't understand how much I love y'all so much like y'all are so amazing like y'all are starting to interact with me on my videos and I love that like I like when y'all talk to me it makes me feel like my work or my time or you know what I'm doing is not in vain I like that like I'm enjoying it so continue doing that so comment down below you know different things that you want to ask if you want to ask me questions i'm all open for it if you want to learn different things i'm always open for it. like people ask me questions on snapchat all the time and i do not mind answering any question that you want to know like anything that you want to know just ask me i'll tell you i feel like i'm not going to be that youtuber who hides everything like where they gonna do this? Where they gonna do that? And that, I mean, to some that might not be a good business move, but to me, I feel like it's not always about business. Sometimes it's about helping the next person because a lot of people don't know how to edit. A lot of people don't know how to do certain things, and I'd be like, you know, it's it's 
it's okay. Somebody had to teach me too, you know? And maybe I did do research, but somebody had to teach me that. But it is what it is. But y'all, I'm over and done with this look, as y'all can tell. And I really thank you guys for, you know, watching this video and taking your time to get ready with me. And um, make sure you tell a friend that knows another friend that your girl, London Marie, is in the place to be. Say what, say what, in the place to be. And y'all, make sure if you aren't a sweetie heart and this is your first time, subscribe and hit that notifications button, okay? I'll see you guys later. They don't have to read it. Sooner or later, they gonna pay attention. My family calling me like, be you did it. It's just level one, but trust I'm about to get it. And I forgave niggas and they opinions. It's funny now you got it. But all my life there's nothing more appealing Then to know that you was close to winning Cause when I say I want it